Hey, my name is Kaya Athena and today I'm bringing you a book review from my holiday location and the book review is on Snapshot by Brandon Sanderson. This is a novella. It is about two detectives. The story takes place in 2018 but it is a futuristic 2018 in which the people have the technology to recreate what's called a to create what's called a snapshot and that is a recreation of the city how it was exactly that day for one day and then the the, the two detectives of this story uh, they go in there and they investigate crimes that way but then they stumble upon a rather serious crime now I should start off this video by saying that I am a huge fan of Brandon Sanderson's writing. I haven't read all of his books, but I have read a lot of them and I've liked a lot of them. Um, in general, I prefer not to start a series if it's not finished yet. I will um, buy the books, but I might not necessarily start the series until it's finished. Um, so I own a lot of Brandon Sanderson's books, but some of them I haven't read yet because the series aren't finished. And also, I'm, I like to kind of savor them, so I'm only reading one every once in a while. Anyway, I am a fan of what he writes. I usually like his novels more than his short stories, though. I am... Um, it's kind of heavy holding this book up the whole time. Uh, he has written a number of short stories as well, and I, but I prefer his more novels. Um, he mostly writes fantasy and this is, I think, classified as a fantasy detective story, is what I would call it. And I enjoyed reading this book. It was suspenseful and it was uh, nice trying to figure things out with the detectives, how, what, what happened and what had happened. Um, the main character is called Davis and his partner is called Chaz. And I would say those are uh, kind of the main characters of the story. Now, I just finished this book and I am stunned by a few twists at the end though that I didn't expect. Now, being a fan of Brandon Sanders' work, he does like to uh, sometimes do twists at near the end of one of, of his books. Um, so in that sense, I guess I was expecting that, but I wasn't expecting what the twists were, if that makes sense. Um, I can't. Like, I'm still wrapping my head around it, I'm still trying to sort of process it, what it exactly means. Um, I am feeling quite tired, uh, because we've been doing some things on our holidays, so I'm tired. And uh, so maybe not in the right frame of mind to be processing something like this, but I, I don't know, but well, I, I enjoyed it overall. It might be one that I, I'll read in the future. I'm definitely going to continue to read his books because like I said I'm, I'm a big fan of, of a lot of his work. But there are still some books of him that I haven't read yet um, but I do plan to read them in time. Uh, I am however a fan of paperbacks rather than hardcovers so I usually wait until a medium sized paperback is released because I really don't like huge hardcovers, they're a bit hard for my hands to hold. This is this is a hardcover but it doesn't have a dust jacket and I don't like dust jackets anyway. That has nothing to do with just the actual story. Um, so yeah, I liked it, I didn't love it like I, I do with some of his books but I definitely like this book so yeah. Thank you very much for watching this video, bye!